What's going on? Hey, have you guys eaten at Campbell's Neighborhood Restaurant right over 9470 in Pinnacle Peak? Because if you haven't, you're totally missing out, especially if you live close by here. Take a look, we've been trying to get in here for, it's embarrassing to say, probably like two years because we always see a ton of people out there, but we finally made it check out what our experience was like and please guys if you've been there please share with us what you've tried what you like what you suggest other people should try and let us know how you liked it check it out all right so we i would have loved to do this right in front of the restaurant and i tried but it was so noisy there's people eating there's cars driving by so it, it just was too hard to do so right here in the neighborhood it's perfect beautiful quiet anyway so it's been probably a couple of years since we've tried to get in here because we always see a ton of people outside and people waiting to get a table so we thought that you know it's got it's got to be good right got to try it and it's literally kitty corner to our neighborhood and we love that so we got in there this morning and uh no we got in there yesterday morning at about 9 a.m we got right in and got a table for two outside on the patio I love the fact that they extended the patio. They added another one off to the side, which did not used to be there before. So that's great. A lot more outdoor seating. I had the uh, avocado toast, which was really good and delicious. So definitely I would recommend that. And then my wife had the blueberry pancakes, which says that they're voted best in Phoenix. So definitely was worth a shot. Now, one thing that I would tell you is when those pancakes came out and they were hot, it was delicious, totally like melts in your mouth. It has a blueberry cream cheese or something that they give you to put on top. But we really took our time because the kids were uh, having a sleepover at grandma. So we just took our time and chatted and, and they got cold. Once they got cold, not so good. You guys know me, I love sweets, I love pastries. I would tear that up and leak, lick the plate. But I didn't this time because it just wasn't worth the calories <laughs> since I'm trying to shit off some pounds. So if you get it, make sure you eat it when you first get it when it's hot and warm. It's absolutely delicious. Now you guys know if you follow me, almost everywhere I go I have to try their Bloody Mary. And I have to say their Bloody Mary was not amazing. It's good. But because I try so many in so many different places, there's other places that I absolutely love that I think are much better. If you want to try one of those close by here, it would be V's Tap Room. It's one of my favorite ones uh, over at Vistancia Golf Club. So, you know, maybe you'll love it. I don't know, give it a try. For me, it wasn't one of the best. Um, the coffee was absolutely delicious. Uh, we are big coffee drinkers, so just the, the coffee taste really does make a difference to us. For me, for example, I don't drink it to stay awake or to give me energy. I drink it for the taste. I love the taste. Um, so in my opinion, it's one of the best coffees I've had. I think it's better than the Starbucks coffee. I think it's better than Circle K, Dunkin' Donuts. Um, so coffee was really good. So that was our experience. Um, I hope you guys give it a try. Cool thing now that they open the patio more, they're opened every day. They used to be just the Saturday and Sunday. Now they're open every day from eight to three. Go try them out. Please share with us your experience. Let us know how you liked it. Let us know what dishes you liked and what we should try next time because we're definitely going back. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I appreciate it. Give it a shot. It's a mom and pop's place and we'd love to support them. Have a good day.